What's up, LHS? Welcome back to your Blue Devil News. I'm Elena. And I'm Dylan. We only have nine days until graduation. Please go by guidance and fill out your information sheet so that guidance will know where to send your final transcripts after graduation. Tassel Hassel, Moving Up Pep Rally, and Field Day have been moved to tomorrow, and Senior Takeover Day is May 13th. You can receive your pink permission slip from the teacher or staff member that you will be taking over. Slips must be signed and turned in to Mr. Per Year in B112 no later than May 9th. Seniors, if you attended Sam Houston Elementary School, they would like to honor you with a reception on Tuesday, May 14th. See info on the board across from the cafeteria or in guidance. We would like to congratulate Sam Burton for being the first student in Wilson County Schools to participate in a Career Technical Education Signing Day. He is being recognized not only for his outstanding work within the criminal justice program here at LHS, but also for receiving a conditional offer for employment from a law enforcement agency in the state of Tennessee. After graduation pending successful completion of the official hiring process, Sam will be employed and will begin his criminal justice career here in Tennessee. Sam also plans to continue his post-secondary education while employed. AP Macro Review is held every Monday and Wednesday in B112 with Mr. Per Year. If you are unable to attend, you can schedule a different time with Mr. Per Year after school. Choir auditions for next year will begin May 14th. See Ms. Fitzgerald on A704 for more information. Do you need a sports physical? From now until August 31st, visit any local Care Now Urgent Cares and get your physical for only $20. This is the closest one over by Publix and no appointment is needed. All textbooks and library books are due today, Wednesday, May 8th, by 1 o'clock. If you do not turn in your materials by then, you will not receive your cap and gown on Thursday. Final exams will be administered on May 22nd and 23rd. Students may leave campus after exams with a written parent permission. Students are responsible for bringing a parent note to the main office before the 20th. Skills USA will have its final meeting of the year today after school. Any members interested in running for an officer position next year should pick up an application from Mr. Lakeman and plan to give their campaign speech at the meeting. Congratulations to Sakura Patton for signing with Greenville University. Um, I kind of refer to Sakura as a quiet leader. Sakura is not that girl that's going to get in your face and, and possibly pump you up and yell at you. Um, Sakura is the one that's going to walk up to you and tell you she believes in you um, and pat you on your side and, and tell you, I got you, I'll help you out. And it, and it makes a difference in the team, it makes a difference in, in the people that she plays with. She not only just plays the game of volleyball, but she elevates her teammates in that silent role. Um, Sakura came in and just just like Coach Bruce, we were like, okay, let's see what she's going to do. And, and every year we're like, okay, let's see what she's going to do next year. Um, Sakura by far is probably one of the best players I've ever coached to be able to to place the ball um, so quality from, from a serve, from an attack, um, by far in the middle of her swing in the air. We can tell her where we want and she'll change it up and, and, and hit it. And I've watched her evolve from, from freshman year to senior year, um, playing travel ball and just the, the skill level go. So I'm extremely, extremely proud to, to see you continue to play on college because you definitely should be playing in college. Um, sad to see you go. <laughs> Definitely sad to see you go, um, but extremely excited for for your new adventure off the college. Um, Coach Lowe couldn't be here, but she definitely told me to tell you good luck and that she misses you and that she wishes you all the all the best. And please keep her updated on everything that you do from from here on out. Um, and you can tell by the faces in this room that you are definitely supported and you have a support system. I definitely see somebody here all the way from a whole other school. I'm not even mad at you. <laughs> um, so before we get on with this and you know mom has got some good old chicken, I need two pieces. Don't walk away because I need two pieces. I need two pieces of chicken. I'm going to allow some words to say, to say some words. Um, I'd like to thank my mom you know, for helping me through the recruiting process and I um, always being my second um, thank Bruce and McGregor for getting me started and always encouraging me and supporting me coming to all my games here tonight. It means a lot and I love you guys. Um, Eddie, um, <laughs> 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 I 
It's four years. <laughs> um, it's four years. It's always been the best. I'm gonna miss you, but thank you for always like pushing me to be the best. You always encouraged me. You know, we had some rough times, but <laughs> um, this coach could not be here. But I just like to thank her. You know, for always being there for me. I had some good times, I had some bad times, but she's always believed in me and like always giving me these one on ones. It really means a lot. So thank you, Coach Glow. <laughs> Okay. Well, with that being said, we're going to go ahead and sign, sign. some pictures of the We're so proud of you. How's the peach sales going on now through May 19th? This is a huge fundraiser for our organization, and your support of this event is greatly appreciated. And last but not least, some track members are competing tonight at sectionals at Austin P, which is the qualifying round for the state championship. BDN's own Spencer Lowry set a new school record in the 300 hurdles. And the relay team, Nate Green, Chandler Flesh, Ethan Nizek, and Spencer Lowry broke their previous school record as well. Some of the seniors decided to brighten Mr. Walters by giving him a card with some words of encouragement. So the seniors got together and presented Mr. Walters with this note. Thank you, thank you note. I'm sure it says good stuff. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. You want me to read it out loud? I'm sure. Not, I'm not going to read it out loud. Dear Mr. Dr. Scott Walters, as a collective group, the students of the senior class want to thank you for all that you have done for us these past four years. Your involvement with the school doesn't go unnoticed. We just wanted to thank you for pushing us every day to be the best Blue Devils we could possibly be. Your positive attitude makes this school a better place. Be cool, be nice, be smart. Learn something today. Love the LHS seniors. Hug all around. Cool. We almost made it a whole school year without headlining on local news. Thank you to Fox 17 News for breaking our streak. Well, that's all the news we have today, LHS. I'm Dylan. And I'm Elena. And this, this has been, been news, news to you from, from the White and Blue. blue. Miss Nick, did you see that one take? Yeah. That's double pizza for me. Yeah, yeah. me too. Yeah, Man. Really, Anna